Jacksons, I'm Julia. Today is Monday, January 4th. Hope you had a wonderful winter break. Welcome back to school and welcome to Finn. If you need to visit campus, make sure you complete the student health check and wear a mask that covers your nose and mouth. In general school news, we want to give a huge congratulations to Kenzie Loman, who was selected as a class of 2021 Ferris Lilac Princess. Kenzie is a senior taking college classes through Running Start and hopes to continue at Eastern Washington University after graduation to pursue a career in health and fitness. We are very proud to have Kenzie represent Ferris in this year's Lilac Court competition. Yearbook needs your help. Send in your photo, Saxons. This week, Yearbook will be welcoming photos that show your fair Saxon fashion. Did you know that Yearbook is having a half-price special sale until February 1st? Until then, the Yearbook is only $20. After that, the price goes up if there are any available on the day of distribution. So, order before February 1st to guarantee your Yearbook. Now on to activities and club news. Remember that stage crew meets on Tuesdays at 12.15 and math club meets on Wednesdays at 3 o'clock. Also, theater club is meeting on Thursday this week. Support the Ferris Action Network and Blessings Under the Bridge and help the homeless population of Spokane get through winter by dropping off jeans, t-shirts, hoodies, sweatshirts, boots, hats, tennis shoes, gloves, socks, backpacks, blankets, or sleeping bags to the Red Barrel located in the main lobby during Ferris office hours. Now onto the Faces of Ferris. Today's Faces of Ferris highlights the student services team. Good morning, Saxons. I'm Mr. Carter, Assistant Principal of Student Services, and today I'm going to introduce you to the members of the student services team. Even without you in the building, our student office team is hard at work. While I'm one of the new faces here at Ferris this year, I can't tell you how excited I am to be back home. I'm a proud Saxon myself, class of 1990, and I'm really looking forward to getting you back in the building. Until then, please know that we're here for you, and whatever you need, Ferris is family, and we're here to help. Hello Ferris High School, Mr. Covell here. We are excited to be sending this video out to you. We want to welcome all of you who are viewing this video, especially our freshmen. It's hard to start out the year not being in building and not seeing you guys. So freshmen, welcome to Ferris. I will primarily be working with 10th graders this year, but I will work with any grade level, anytime, anyplace, anywhere. Please reach out to us if you need anything. We miss you and go Saxons. Hey Saxons, it's Mrs. Leonard. I'm working with the 11th graders this year. And I just want you guys to know that we miss you and um, I'm excited to be here. I'm a new face. Um, our student services team is here to help. So reach out to us, let us know what we can do to help you have a better year. Until we see you in the building, have a great time. Now for sports news. Sports seasons have been rescheduled with winter sports scheduled to start in January, fall sports scheduled to start in March, and spring sports in April. In order for those sports to start, Spokane County will still need to meet the previously announced COVID metrics, so do your part and wear your mask. It's not too early to start thinking about registration for next year. We will be registering in February and it will be here before you know it. Here is some information on some of the classes available here at Ferris. Saxons, welcome to the art department. You're in the ceramics room and we want you to know that in ceramics you get to do hand building and wheel throwing. So we've got 10 wheels so that we can throw pots like that. Let me show you some of the other projects that we do in ceramics. We make other size bowls too, smaller bowls on the wheel. And we can take this bowl and turn it into a soup mug. We also make plates on the wheel, but that's not the only way we make plates. We make plates with molds and just taking a simple chinette plate, two of them, and sandwiching the clay between them, you can make a ceramic plate. 
all of our projects that you glaze are usable. You can eat off them. You can put them in the microwave. You can put them in the dishwasher. You could make a set of plates. That's a slab construction. We also make bowls with slab construction. Isn't that nice texture? And there's fun projects too. This is done with pinch pots. Big mouth pinch pots with a fly in his mouth. They're lots of fun. Come down and join us. And this is a coil construction with a carved design. Here's a teapot. It's got the dragonfly on it too. And you can even see inside that you strain your tea when you pour it out. Because like I said, everything is usable. And we do ugly face jugs. And this is just not one face, but two faces. We also have drawing classes. Let me show you some of the art that we've done in the past. We work in a variety of media. There is charcoal up here, pen and ink, marker, color pencil, scratch board, and printmaking. And then the last one is transfer design. So drawing is all about making the mark and creating that illusion that it is three-dimensional. We don't just have those two classes, but we also have painting. Realistic, we paint abstract. We use a variety of different supplies, acrylic, watercolor, powdered watercolor, and liquid watercolor, tempera paint. And if you're really serious about art, we also have AP art portfolios. We have three of them. Um, you could do a 2D design portfolio that's a lot like this one behind me. Something like that would work in a design portfolio. We have a drawing portfolio where this portrait would be a really nice addition to a drawing portfolio. Or we have a 3D portfolio in all of the ceramic works that I showed you before. Those are some of the examples that you could put into a 3D portfolio. So we do have two art teachers here and Mrs. Davis is going to tell you about the drawing, sculpting and painting classes. Hope to see you in the art department for some creative play, right? If you are a senior, visit the college and career pages on the senior website to find the monthly senior newsletter, information on financial aid, FAFSA, scholarships, virtual college rep visits, and more. Contact Dawn Hilsender at dawnh at spokaneschools.org if you need help with FAFSA or any other senior related topics. Support the Ferris High School Class of 2021 by recycling your holiday tree at the Tree Recycling Senior All-Nighter Fundraiser. Drop off your trees from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. this Saturday the 9th and Sunday the 10th in the Ferris High School parking lot at the corner of Regal and 37th. It's $5 to drop off the tree and $10 for pickup. All proceeds go to support the Class of 2021 Senior All-Nighter. Call or text Sherry at 509-599-2570 or Tanya at 509-599-5958 for pickup. Senior Portraits deadline is now February 1st. Submit your senior photo online or email it to at tindc at That's it for Finn. Thanks for joining us today. Stay healthy, safe, and six feet away. And make sure to stay tuned for a post show. Bye!